this is what's opening up in streaming this week. Okay, what do we got? On Thursday, January the 12th, which is today, we've got The Climb. Amateur climbers go through a series of mental and physical challenges in a competition to crown the world's best amateur climber, starring Jason Momoa. I didn't even hear, hear this. I mean, I, I would watch that show. A reality like, competition show of some mm -hmm. kind? I feel like of all the stars, it's like Jason Momoa just keeps appearing in stuff that I didn't even know he was going to be. <laughs> yeah. Right. Slumberland, which is pretty good. He does. Next up, also opening today. <laughs> Finally, Rob has been yes. counting down the days. <laughs> Game day. Game day. Game day. Velma. The origin of the sleuth and member of the Mystery Inc. gang, Velma, starring Mindy Kaling, <laughs> Ming-Na Wen. I, I do. I got to admit, I love the promo picture saying, get ready for some main character energy. <laughs> I, I do like that a lot. Unfortunately, I'm not hearing very good things about it. Like I've heard from a number of people who uh, just... Nobody likes it, unfortunately, which will make it awkward when uh, next week we launch our Velma <laughs> After Show with Robert Meyer Burnett, <laughs> followed at 10 o'clock by the Velma After Show After Show being host hosted by Ray Ora. So oh, it's going to yeah. be a where we review Rob's reaction, <laughs> where we will review Rob's reaction to Velma. Uh, so that comes out today. Next up, we've got coming out on Netflix. Also, I believe today, Vikings Valhalla Season 2. This is the follow-up series to Vikings, which I really, really enjoyed. Up until the last... I, I checked out the last couple seasons when my, my main character died, but I really love the show up to that point. This oh, one wow. takes place uh, of his grandchildren set 100 years after the events of Vikings. Opening up tomorrow, Dog Gone with Rob Lowe. Huh? Uh, based on the true story of a father and son who repair their fractured relationship during a forced hike of the Appalachian Trail to find their beloved lost dog. Nothing will bring people together like their shared love over a lost dog. It's true, though. And now, there's the sequel to this is about how they take their cats out into the woods and hope they hey, get hey, lost. Hey, 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 hey. I didn't make the movie. Them's no. fighting That's, words. I'm Don't just, start I'm just the messenger. Don't start talking kitties around me and Jonathan Boyk. Oh. <laughs> okay, next up. Also opening, we've got on oh, Hulu, The Drop. In this cringe comedy, a married couple face a marriage test when one of them drops a baby during a tropical island wedding. What? Uh, yes, wow. That doesn't not, that poster doesn't scream quality. <laughs> I don't think I'm really Is that her expression at the movie. moment? <laughs> wow. It dropped into her, their hands. Someone's got to hire Ray Ora to design their artwork. That yeah. poster looks like a college film project oh. report. That's a horrible poster. And at the same time it says it all exactly but i but i'm sad about this because i love jillian bell i love her everything she's been in i mean from workaholics to when she was on curb your enthusiasm i just think she's so funny and can do no wrong but clearly she can because this looks like blame her garbage. agents all team. right her also opening well. up tomorrow we've got hunters season two uh, so that one, a lot of people, I never really did. I, I watched a little bit of it. I didn't really get into it myself, the first season of it. But I know some people that really love this show. It was pretty good. Yeah, I didn't finish I the mean, first one. I mean, I'm not going to lie. Anybody killing Nazis, they got my, they got my yeah. money. All right. Then we've got, also opening up, we got on Apple TV Plus, Servant Season 4. I have never watched this show. Is but that Rupert Grint? I only, yep, the, he's in that. Only, I only know of a couple of people in the show. A couple of people I know who watch this show. But they both really like it. Have any of you guys watched Servant? No. I watched some of the first season, but I haven't caught back up with it. It was intriguing. All right. Now, opening up on Sunday. Sunday. Sunday, Sunday. Come on, man. The Last of Us. Yeah. Finally. Finally. Comes to HBO Max. This is a day that will be long remembered. And we will be watching. I'm very, very excited about this. So that comes out on Sunday. Also... Mayor of Kingstown, season two with Jeremy Renner. Uh, this show is fantastic. It is. Like, it's, and I, it's just a, one of these shows that snuck onto Paramount Plus. Now, Paramount Plus is on a few more people's radars these days than it was a year ago. But this movie just kind of snuck in. I, I can't tell you, Rob, how many times I've talked to people about, oh, and Jeremy Renner, like, the show of Mayor of Kingstown. I'm like, what? Like, how many people have ever even heard of this, this show? It's Taylor Sheridan, too. <clears throat> it's also Taylor Sheridan who does Yellowstone and. Uh, 1883 and 1923. It's great. And season two returns. And uh, that is it. So, Rob, let me throw it over to you. We had a bunch of stuff on here. Obviously, Last of Us. Of course. Uh, but so a little bit of your anticipation about Last of Us and what else is standing Well, out? Hunters, because I like the first season. And, and, you know, Al Pacino is it. 
I'll say hamming it up a little bit, <laughs> but uh, it's a little bit, you know, and, and, and that's a lot to say for Al Pacino, but it's fun to watch him. And the cast is pretty good and the villains are truly villainous. So it is a fun, it is a fun show. And I have to tell you that I'll watch that mountain climbing show with Jason Momoa. I kind of like this new, this new genre of show where they take movie stars like Will Smith, uh, Chris Hemsworth, now Jason Momoa, where they go out into nature. I think this you know? is more of a competition show, though, where he's like the host. Of course, but right. they're still, you know, going out into the world. They're doing, I mean, you know, Chris Hemsworth. I just like seeing stars interacting with Mother Nature. All right. I mean, the Chris Hemsworth Limitless show is pretty cool. Uh, I liked it. But, yeah, this is a competition show. But still, I want to see Jason Momoa, like, on the ground while people are dangling off outcroppings, perhaps falling to their deaths. No, it Probably looks won't. good. I, and I think, but... you know what, the idea of that show, as far as competition shows go, I'll watch that show because you can't fake mountain climbing. So, Aaron, I mean, obviously, Last of Us with a lot of us, but any of the other shows on here that are jumping out to you that you're going to be racing to watch this week? I mean, no Velma. No, I have no interest in watching that. Um, I'm actually on Rob's side. I, I, Tom and I will. We cannot even start an episode of Survivor because when we start one episode, we just binge all 22 and then we get nothing done. So this looks like a show that, um, I mean, I love the competition aspect of it. And this is the kind of reality TV that I enjoy watching. I don't need to see a bunch of people, you know, arguing in a house or a hot tub. I don't need to see, um, you know, people being mean to each other. I want to see people really pushing themselves because you get into the psychology of it. And that's what's exciting to me. And Jason Momoa, um, even when he's not, um, we, we've seen a little bit of his personality on the red carpet and in interviews, and he just looks like a really fun guy. I met him at Comic-Con in New York years ago um, when he was promoting Conan. Yeah, Conan. And I was there doing stuff for Spartacus. And he was really nice and personable and charming and funny. And I think that um, he he's going to be really a great host to this because he also has the physicality. And I think that he's going to be exercising some of that. And um, I, I feel like there's a little bit of a lose, biggest loser element of not necessarily weight loss or gain or anything, but just the the um, him almost being a, in a trainer like atmosphere. All right, guys, question is for you. Do you have any shows on that list that are coming on streaming this week that you're particularly excited about seeing? Obviously, all of us are for Last of Us, but are there any others? For me, it's Mayor of Kingstown. Whatever you guys think, jump down to the comments section below and let us know your thoughts. Guys, we want to take a second and thank the sponsor of this video, Helix Sleep. Guys, let me tell you, just a couple of days ago, Ann and I received our Helix mattress, and it is the best mattress we have ever slept on in our entire lives. We had like this $3,000 specialized mattress that we got like five, six years ago, and we liked it very much, but this one completely outdoes it. It's night and day and you can get matched with your perfect mattress too. See, Helix Sleep has a quiz that takes just like a minute to complete, and it matches your body type and sleep preferences to the perfect mattress for you. Why would you buy a mattress made for somebody else? With Helix, you're getting a mattress that you know will be perfect for the way that you sleep. I hopped online, took the Helix quiz, and Anna and I were matched with the perfect mattress for us, and it is so easy to set up. Simply take it out of the box, get it positioned on your mattress, take off the plastic, and then give it an hour to to breathe to reach its full size and you will not believe how comfortable this thing is. All you got to do is go to helixsleep.com slash campia. Take their 60 second sleep quiz and they'll match you to a customized mattress that will give you the best sleep of your life. And it's risk free. They have a 10 year warranty and you get to try it out for 100 nights. They'll even pick it up for you if you don't love it, but you will. Helix even has financing options and flexible payment plans so a great night's sleep is never far away. And here's the best part. Helix is offering up to $200 off of all mattress orders and two free pillows for our listeners at helixsleep.com com slash campia 